So to begin with, copper. Well, copper's a natural element and you can actually dig it out of the ground. You can, and also you can find it on the periodic table. In other words, it's not made up of any other component parts. Now, copper is highly conductive and also extremely resistant to heat, which is why it's used in electrical systems and also for plumbing. Now, brass, on the other hand, is an alloy, which means it's made up of different elements. In this case, zinc and copper. The amount of zinc and copper in brass can change its color. For example, if there is more zinc in the brass, then it's more yellow in color than red. That's what gives it its gold look. Bronze is also an alloy and is usually made up of tin and copper. It's highly uh, resistant to corrosion, which is why it's used on ships. It's also extremely hard wearing, which is why it's used in bearings and also used for sculptures. 